We all have a passion. Wrestling has been uh, the life lesson teacher of my life. We all have dreams. When I was growing up, I used to wrestle and live with my brother, seven, eight years old, pretend like we're in the Olympic finals. We all have that one thing we live for. You go to Texas and it's what, football, baseball, here it's wrestling. You take away that, everyone's gonna freak. So what would happen if all those things were taken away? I woke up at six to run in the morning and I checked Twitter and that's the first thing I read and I was like, what? I felt like I got kicked in the gut and I just, I thought it was a joke, I really did. I just, uh, I was astounded. Last week, the International Olympic Committee voted to cut wrestling from the 2020 Olympic Games. Even though the sport has roots in the ancient Greece games and it has been a part of every Olympics since they began in 1896. This has left a lot of people wondering if wrestling should have even been one of the sports considered to cut. Not in my opinion, my goodness man. It's a bedrock sport. It's been on ESPN, it's been on all of these social media sites and um, other Olympians from other sports have even stepped up about it. It's one of the oldest sports, if not the oldest, and um, it represents everything of a sport. When it comes to wrestling, I mean, how much harder do you want to get? How much more of a, of a dedicated person do you want? Another interesting aspect about wrestling is the Olympics is the championship for wrestling. It's the ultimate goal. Wrestling, all we really have is the Olympics. When you think of the Olympics, for me at least, I think of swimming, gymnastics, wrestling. Some of those, I don't, you don't think of golf. I think of the Masters for golf. You know, soccer's a World Cup. You know, basketball, we have our World, you know, we have the NBA championship. Tennis even, ten, I mean, what do you think, Wimbledon? That's their Super Bowl, you know? So the Olympic sports, this is the Super Bowl for them. So what happens now to all those hopes and dreams of young wrestlers? those truly affected by this decision. What are these kids going to look forward to? Like, they need a reason to wrestle, you know? The Olympics is always in the back of your mind when you're young and you're a wrestler. But you take that from them, it's like, it kind of takes out the point, you know? That, uh, you know, they're pointing, they want a shot at trying to make an Olympic team and compete in Olympic games. And right now, that's really obviously knocked them off, their, off the track right now. Now that they've taken that away, it's just kind of like, Sorry, kid, you know, this is the line, this is it, you know, you got college, and that's it. Coach Miller feels there's only one thing to do. The trickle-down effect, if it doesn't get changed for the sport of wrestling in, in the U.S., it just could be disastrous, it really could. You know? So, we got to get this changed. Period. Reporting for Sports Night, I'm Shelby Granath.